Beyond the official ceremonies, independence activists held a march in Taipei to remember the thousands killed in the aftermath of the 228 crackdown. They asked that the true history of the era be reflected in textbooks and asked the KMT to pay compensation owed to victims. When the clock hit 228 Thursday afternoon, the Remember the March Massacre parade began. DPP bigwigs Su Zhencheng and Tsai Ing-wen led the parade, while followers held up signs and others carried flowers to remember the tragedy 66 years ago. Beginning 66 years ago with the 228 incident, Taiwan's people experienced state violence, experienced the white terror. February 28th is a memorial day and as a day for self-examination. It's also a day where we show resolve to move forward. Compensation for 228 victims should not be paid with taxpayer funds. It should be paid from the assets of the KMT, which made a major mistake. Huang Kunhui, the chairman of the Taiwan Solidarity Union, urged that the historical tragedy not be repeated. The 228 incident was a tragedy resulting from two different cultures being forced together. If Taiwan were unfortunately annexed by China, another 228 incident would very likely occur. About 2,000 people took part in the parade which wound its way from Yongle Market to Liberty Plaza. They hope that people will learn a lesson from history.